guys welcome back to the channel hope you've all had a great christmas and new year and still enjoying the holidays if you're off work but here we are episode five of the road to b license now don't get me wrong in the last races from no fault of his own we have had some bad luck but new year new start all we can do is keep our heads up but yeah um do excuse the coughing i've still got mad man flu but it's not going to stop us from racing and sim racing as we all usually do but yeah here we are at spa frankenchamps racing the gt3 um we did qualify first with a two minute 21.4 which don't get me wrong we were in a, a worse split than everyone else due to his i rating but nothing we can do about that all we can do now is focus on getting it back up and winning races and keeping it clean so if you're enjoying the videos guys please give us a like and subscribe so here we are then guys, here at Spa Frankenchamps um, in the Ferrari 296 GT3 New year, new start You know, don't get me wrong, we've had a, a few bad races with no fault of his own with his I rating going down but here we are, it's a fresh start and see what we can do in 2024 I still have bad man flu so do excuse me Still battling it though, sim racing. We are preparing for a rolling start. Going up Blanchemont, up to the bus stop chicane. And then it's go, go, go. I'd be happy to finish in top three here. <coughs> Providing the qualifying we had. Oh, here we are. Hopefully it's not a boring race where I just set off and lead the whole all of the um, seven eight laps. But technically, I would like that easy race, as I'm sure everyone would. But we really do need safety points and I rating back, so. Let's try and keep out of trouble and finish this race no matter what. It was go, go, go. Someone. I expected him straight to be behind me then. Hit me from behind, race over. So, we're at the first corner up the Rouge. We are first. Surprising getting off track there. Not the best racing line. See what we can do. Another incident behind. Let's bring this baby home. That's what I say. New year. On to better things. As they say. Rappy corner. So, nearly end at first lap, going up Blanchemont. Up it in the first gear, going up bus stop chicane. 
of an outbreak. Outbreaker there. Bit of a boo boo. Scrappy, scrappy, scrappy. It's not letting put me off. Should have a bit of draft. Went down Kemmel straight. Fair enough, he's driving right in his head. Nice to have a bit of respect on the track, because lately we haven't right seen that. better so it's dropped him by 0 0.8 tenths is that 1.1 behind us His last lap was a uh, one two twenty four eight. This is a uh, another two twenty four eight. Oh, no, it wasn't. It was two twenty two dead. Still sticking with me. Has he gone off? He's gone off. Cookie crumbled for Chris. Three point seven behind. So no off tracks yet. Three point seven behind. Three point two. Or a what that were two twenty two. 
One. Now you've got to look, love Spa, aren't you? Especially our Rouge, it's so iconic and you know there's been so many talks about it getting being banned for that corner. Don't get me wrong, it is dangerous but motorsport is a dangerous sport and you know you can't take that away from it. So in my opinion I think they should keep it. <coughs> Five point one behind me. Now this Ferrari two nine six, in my opinion, is definitely more stable than the new new Audi that came out, the new LMS Evo. Especially some corners. in third place has done the fastest lap with a 2.21.2 it's another lap down Slightly missing my breaking point. Going into the first corner. Chris is now 4.7 behind. So he's 5.5 behind now. now. Don't get me wrong, we are e we are winning quite easily. But this is only due down to us, no fault of his own, with the spl bad splits we've been getting putting in. From idiots from behind. So, it's his mission to build it back up. Guy in second, Jared. He has moved up 16 positions. So the guy's on fire. Does seem to be catching us though. Not get that corner right. Is it going to come down to a last lap battle? 
if it does and if he's putting up a big fight for it he can have it because coming this far I need the points Three point seven behind us. Squeaky bum time is this. Charred is now 3.3 behind. If I remember rightly, this could be the last lap. So the guy should be waving the white flag. One more lap. Let's bring it home. Slightly better. He's 2.7 behind me. Don't know how much he's, how much pace he's finding love to know where but fair play to him he's driving absolute faultless race two point six behind See him in my rear view mirror. There's two point one behind us. One point seven behind us. I think we've done it. I think we've done enough. We'll stop Shakane last corner. There we have it then guys, first win <coughs> of 2024, wow, that's the start we needed boys, well, we've done it, let's pull over and have a look at the results screen. Right then guys, so here we are looking at the results after the race at Spa in the Ferrari 296 GT3. We did it, we finished first with a best lap time of a 2 minute 22. The guy in second was closing in on us quite quickly. His best lap time were a 2 minute 20. So it were 2 seconds a quick 
lap quicker than us. Um, safety rating we have gone up 0.18, so that's a big win for us as well. And desire rating's gone up plus 88, so all in all, a big winner in that race. And uh, I'd say it's a great win to start off the new year. So there we have it then, guys. Thanks for watching. Please give us a like and subscribe.